The former first lady who died yesterday will lie in repose at the library on Wednesday and Thursday so the public can pay its respects. Leslie Stahl of 60 Minutes back in the Reagan years was covering the White House and you knew the president and the first lady well. What do you remember about Nancy Reagan? Well, I guess first off how much she grew as first lady because she came in and she was interested in clothes and shopping and by the end she had become one of the president's foreign policy advisors, domestic policy advisors, image guru and she just developed and you watched it happen. You know I'm really happy to see the flag at half staff on the White House like that because our first ladies are never really appreciated for how much they contribute to the success of the presidency they're involved in, but also, you know, helping keep the country together. And she did that. Mrs. Reagan was an influence on her husband in policy matters. Well, absolutely. Everybody knows that she pushed him into a detente with Gorbachev at the Soviet Union, but she was also trying to get him to really stop talking as much as he was on the social issues, the more conservative positions he was taking, for example, on abortion and on gun control. And of course, he didn't always listen to her. She was a power behind the throne, you would say? Absolutely, no question about it. She was protecting him. She was protecting his image. She was protecting the presidency. But it was an authentic love story. Oh, complete, total. You see it on camera, and it was real. Leslie Stahl of 60 Minutes. Leslie, thanks so much. Pleasure.